about how the scoring goes for the mud bust and the, the winner of the, the, the term who wins? Yeah. Okay. It's a little bit tough to score. Um, we try to space, you know, how well they stay centered on the mud. Uh, you know, they're not exceptionally powerful animals. So, so, it, so, it, so it's called mutton bust. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So uh, they're not exceptionally powerful animals. You might have, you know, if you watch the show, you might notice the kid get off center and the sheep tips over. Right. So, you know, it's mainly about the duration of the ride, looking for at least six seconds, and how fast it is, how well the kid stays still. Yeah, I remember saying the other day that a kid stayed on the whole way, and they had to grab the kid off of it. And he's still hanging on. Right, he didn't right, want to let go. Right, he, right, sometimes right. those kids are voracious, man. Right. They, they, they told to hang on as hard as they could, and that's what they did. Okay. All right. Thank you for your time. I am Andre Owens with the Chain Views News and Issues live at NRG Stadium, in Houston, Texas. And you think I'm square? <laughs> I'll see you after the show. Not. Now, what's it gonna be? Are you gonna build your railroad in Cactus Gulch? Yes. Oh, this just makes me so emotional. Excuse me, everybody. So. <laughs> Celebrate the reformed railroad rolling. Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip! <laughs> Let's get all of our star performers back on stage, everybody. Coming up here, kids. Coming up here, railroad rolling. Use the stairs, everybody. Be sure to get all your pictures. sure when you're done with your pictures and your costumes to put them on the edge of the stage. Now kids, look at your lovely families and audience and friends. Hands up high. Okay, we have Tanner Lee here and she the video. Uh, yeah, performs the cutest little show for the kids. Tell us about uh, how this is formed and um, um, how do you go about uh, getting the kids dressed in these different uh, uniforms. Basically, the whole concept of this show is it's around the kids. We are all about building their confidence, their self-esteem, and we want kids to come out. We want them to have fun and enjoy themselves. Um, so when we dress them up, it's it's so fun and they look so cute and so adorable. And that's the point of costumes. And if they're not in costume, it's okay because we have sound effects, and that's it's it's all fun for the whole family. So how do you go about putting together this skit and choosing the people that you work with to put this on? Do they have to be in some type of drama class or something? We usually like people with some theater experience, but if you like kids, we love having you on because you really have to be genuine and really care and have compassion for the show. That's something that can't be faked. Right. So when we pick our people, we pick them based upon kindness and those qualities as people. Right. And we love it if you have theater experience. Okay. And thank you for your time. Thank you. Okay. <laughs>